blocks are crap. So we that's like how we got them. We don't run gullet through them, so it doesn't matter. No. Um, so I'm I saying you wouldn't want to run this very far. But um, and I'm only what we've done is a lot of this stuff has been donated through support. Northern Auto Parts in Sioux City has helped us. Speedway Motors have helped us. Some other um, independent Napa stores and things like that have helped to promote this. Just as a way to go out and kind of a fun recruiting venture and, and uh, go out and do that. Looks like we've got half the Pistons in on this side. What do we got over there, Barry? Okay, it looks pretty nip and tuck. Three and a half minutes. Of course, these guys, they've been doing this quite a bit. I know uh, Southeast Community College of Milford did this exact competition out of the Junction Motor Speedway over in McCool Junction, Nebraska, earlier this year. How many shows a year do these guys do? You know, normally we try and do seven or eight. These guys have really got 17 head bolts on each side, and then they have to torque them, and then we have to come back and get all 16 rocker arms. So we'll see what happens here. Seven and a half minutes. Looks like there's about a, I'm going to say... 30 second lead on the guys in the to north. Send me those. We'll see, my brother still has to really run. excited to watch oh, this. No, Please dude. make sure. Seriously. I tell you, when 15 minutes rolls around, this these engines, they do pump up the volume quite a bit. Of course, that big Chevy power. We, of course, we're always so, glad to have Chevy. Uh, uh, has uh, uh, has Ford ever made yeah. an appearance in this engine building national, competition? Uh, our national sponsor. You know, we've got a Ford guy out here. That's what we don't let him put the distributor in because he always tries to put it in the front. Just doesn't um, work. Put the intake manifold the on that. So we've always done these because they're An cheap. For, um, like, they're easy to get parts for. And here we go. We're gonna flip this side over. He's a really nice Eight man. twenty. Wow. So we'll see. It looks like Team on North got a little Snap bit of a lead, but that big, doesn't big, mean a whole lot yet. Another thing about the tools, you know, we say they're using all hand tools to do this. You know, what kind of a technician can do their job without tools? It just, it just doesn't yeah. work. So one of the cool things about our program is they make all of our students tools. are able to buy a nice set of tools and everything they need I'll send you a video at Nick half King price from your Snap-on Mac, Mac, Go, Cornwell, all your major yeah, tools that like come that. out. So like they want to get the student in their product, knowing that down the road they'll need more. Half price on their tool set is a huge deal compared to some programs that... I don't even know how stuff, much. But then you graduate, you have a job, and now you have to they don't spend a bunch of money to buy tools at this price. Of course, I there's think. still some young talent out there they don't going don't into the college, college process. Uh, where, can, uh, can new, where can new students sign up to well, possibly get into the automotive technician class at SEC of course. It's mutually beneficial. You that's get, a good question. Thanks, and that's the main reason we've done this. He's the guy that does it's fun. We're kind of all gearheads. But... It's to get people excited in what our students are able to do. And so young people that are interested or job retraining too, www.southeast.edu is our website. We do have some application and information brackets, some price sheets, things like that with us. Talk to any of these students. They'll tell you the way it is or very early afterwards. We'll be happy to talk to you about it. Um, or like I say, www.southeast.edu is our website. So putting the gas we're getting on the close rear here end, to the 10 minute the mark. End, I'm going to walk over here a little bit and see what we got on the other so side. See how close we are. are torquing all the head bolts. Looks like we're torquing some cylinder heads and spinning down rocker arms. The rocker arms, they were roughly a minute away from starting them. They do have a brace that goes on the front, keep them from rotating. And when the engine does torque, on the stands. The brace and the stands were built by students in the welding program at SEC in Milford. Hey, 13 minutes, 36 minutes! How about it? We got a winner. North side, you guys win it. Yeah, 13, 36. These guys are just seconds behind. We'll see if it runs better. I didn't. They kind of caught me unaware. I didn't think they were quite that far yet. We'll fire this one up, we'll see if it runs better. They have put tools up, and we are going to be seconds behind and have two engines running in less than 15 minutes. That's what they told me. Let's see where we're at. Last header bolt, tools away. Let's see where we're at. Fuel line, plug wires. See if this is going to run better.